life on a dime and today I wanted to talk to you about medicine cabinet essentials and some more natural alternatives that I have been using for my family and how these happen to be frugal and fit in with those family values as well. I'd like to start by talking about oils for kids. Um, one thing that I do for the kids, you never want to apply a regular essential oil without diluting it first for your kids. So I dilute them with a little almond oil. You can also use grapeseed oil. You can even use olive oil, any vegetable oil really, coconut oil. But I have one roller here with diluted lavender in it. This is just lavender oil and almond oil. And I like to put some behind the kids' ears at bedtime. It can help you relax and get to sleep. It's also very good for skin support. Um, we use this for a lot of boo-boos and skin irritation. It's very soothing for the kids. And my son, since he cut his hand over the summer, um, we have to massage his hand to keep the skin stretching. And I like to use this roller for it keeps them comfy. Keeps it comfy. Um, another thing that I like to do for the kids is a roller of Thieves. Thieves is a great immune support and I just roll this up their spines. I try to remember to do this every single night before they go to bed just to help boost their immunity. And speaking of things, I really like these. Other than the fact that it smells awesome. It smells like Christmas in a bottle, you guys. Um, Thieves is very good, like I said, for immune support. Um, I diffuse this. I clean with Thieves Household Cleaner. And I even like to put the Thieves Vitality, I don't have that out with me, but there's a Thieves Vitality oil that is FDA approved for ingestion. I love to put that in hot tea. One thing I like to do for myself is I have the Thieves Roller that is pre-formulated by Young Living. And I like to roll this up my spine at night as well. Sometimes I roll it on my feet. You get really good absorption on the bottom of your feet. Or if I feel like I'm coming down with something, I may roll it directly over the nodes help get a little extra immune support there since this is where I seem to have most of my issues and this works really well I literally just roll it on here like this and you can walk around smelling like Christmas it's awesome um, I also like I said I diffuse thieves oil I like to put it in my tea the uh, vitality oil oil another oil that I like to use I use this on my husband a lot is the deep relief oil this is formulated with peppermint. It has some lemon oil in it, clove oil, wintergreen leaf oil. It's really nice. You roll it in, it absorbs in, it really helps relieve some tension. Um, if I get a tension headache and I start to hurt in my jaws, I roll this directly over my jaws and it really helps me to relax a little bit. Also, if you just have a headache, um, especially sinus headaches, I get those quite often. Um, or sometimes the kids are just really loud and you get a headache. You can inhale peppermint oil, and peppermint oil is amazing. This was actually free through the Loyalty Rewards program. Um, Ravensara is, I'm probably pronouncing it wrong, but this is an oil I was introduced to when I had shingles earlier this year. And it really just made me hate my skin a little bit less and it made things more comfortable than anything else had. This was just diluted with the carrier oil and I would rub a drop in on the affected areas of my skin a few times a day and it helped with the discomfort a lot. Cannot say how much. I really appreciated that um, when I had shingles. Well, I hope you liked that little glimpse into my family's medicine cabinet because you found some of that information helpful. Um, if you're interested, there are links below. I've got blog posts for more information on what is in my family's medicine cabinet where you can find some of this stuff, as well as links to explore if you're interested in adding essential oils to your daily wellness routine. Stay healthy, my friends. Mm -hmm.